What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? That was a good clap today. We have a very unique product. Not only is it uh, unique in design, it is also unique that a guy is reviewing the Liberty Band from Crossbreed. Uh, this uh, is typically shown off and designed and geared towards the ladies. Guys can absolutely use it, there's nothing wrong with it. And I am secure enough in my manhood to review an item that will mostly be used by ladies because I am not shy. All right, three quick things. Yes, I am a very, very big fan of Crossbreed. You guys have seen a lot of Crossbreed videos over the years. Uh, their chest rig, I've done a couple different ones of their uh, videos on their belly band, my favorite belly band. I've done the Crossbreed Reckoning, which is a great holster. This is the Crossbreed Rogue, which I carry every day. Shadow Systems, Vortex Red Dot. This is what I carry every day, and they're all just comfortable, high quality, made in the States, lots and lots of good things. Second, discount code for them. I've done so much with them. They've given me a discount code for my followers, Tiberius20. If you want to save 20%, use that code. I do get a small kickback, so I appreciate it. Third, quick, quick story. I'm at the NRA show, and I see this Liberty Band, and there's a nice woman standing there, and I say, what is that thing? And I'm kind of like, Tch. What, what is this thing? Like, how does this even work? You know, that's kind of my approach to it. Very nice woman. I'm assuming she's in sales because she does a great job selling me on the benefits and how she uses it and blah, blah, blah. Great, great job. I'm like, oh, she's good. Come to find out it's the owner, <laughs> the owner of Crossbreed. I had never met her until that moment. And uh, our first interaction was me going, what is this thing? Uh, so after that, I said, hey, how about you send me one and let me review it and uh, get some experience and I can see exactly what it's all about. Anyway, I just thought that was kind of funny. Um, this thing is very, very simple. It's a band that most folks wear around their midsection, whether it be stomach or under, or under your breast. I've seen people do appendix and I've done that, but typically right here, a woman under their breast or in their midsection, something like that. I got a little bit of a belly, so it's a little harder for me to do on the stomach, but right here in that... Um, indent where in my chest is that was a perfect spot for me uh, it, it's going to hold any holster with a, a one and a half inch clip if you look here the top section is reinforced and a little bit thicker than the bottom so when you put that holster on there that helps uh keep it in place of course why would you use anything else but a crossbreed sprinkles holster <laughs> but uh that's how it that's how it works on there and then it's simple you just wrap it around your body uh has some velcro on here make sure you wrap it really really tight that's the key is to make sure this band is tight so nothing moves especially if you're doing any type of exercising once you wrap it around your body nice and tight, I like to wrap it around tight, then put the holster on, that's how I do it. And then this other band that covers it, I just wrap the, the other band that covers it around the firearm and it is as simple as that. You can rock multiple locations. Most people are gonna keep it, the firearm right here in the front somewhere. I did see some people carrying three, four o'clock. Now that's gonna be really hard to draw. Think about it, the gun's already up here and now you have to get back here. So how do you shirt up to get to it? Maybe if you're gonna carry it on your back, go a little lower. We're gonna talk about it in testing a little bit, but make sure with anything unique like this, you spend some time uh, dry firing and then spend some time at the range practicing before you walk out the house with it on you. Uh, the last two things I wanna talk about is gonna be uh, the colors, black and FDE, and the price is silly. Again, I know it's a basic little band, but it's only $35, so it's very, very affordable. The one thing I forgot to mention is the material. It is a rubber and, oh crap, I gotta cheat. Nylon and rubber material. It's very, very stretchy, it's very, very breathable, and I did find it comfortable. Um, anytime you're carrying and working out, that area gets stupid warm and sweat and hot, but I did find it very comfortable and breathable. All right, let me talk a little bit about testing because I did a lot of different things because I didn't really know what to take. Uh, I didn't know what to think of this, so I did a lot of different things. I did EDC it. I tried on my belly. Didn't personally like that. I, again, I got a little bit of a dad bud. I carried it right here underneath uh, my breast, right in that, that cutout area, and that was the sweet spot. That was perfect for me. I did try using it appendix uh, right around my waist where I would normally carry. I also tried back three, four o'clock, so different areas to see what I did and didn't like, what was comfortable, et cetera, et cetera. I did some dry fire first, then I went to the range and did some live fire, and I say it was really, really weird at the range. Because normally I just lift my shirt up a little bit and the gun's right there, and I've done that a thousand times. I only carry appendix for the most part. So you've got to really like pull your shirt up much higher and you need to practice that. 
And normally if I have to get to my gun, I don't care. If it's a life or death scenario, I don't care. But I was feeling a little self-conscious doing this on video. I pulled my shirt way up, showing off my dad bod. So I would draw the gun and then I kind of pulled my shirt back down. And it was kind of funny, but whatever. I don't mind making fun of myself. Um, I did try running with the band as well. Again, around my stomach, no bueno. In this little area right here in my chest, perfect. Didn't budge, didn't move as long as I put it down tight. I did, again, try an appendix with basketball shorts, sweatpants, stuff like that that don't have a belt where I can't use a traditional holster. That worked well uh, as well. I will say, if I am going for a run, I prefer the Crossbreed Belly Band. I don't know exactly why. I didn't have any problems with the Liberty Band, but this is, it's bigger, so it sweats more and you and you, you feel that it's warm. I just like, it has extra pockets, so I can put my keys, I can put my phone. I find it more comfortable. I find that the, the gun stays in place better. I don't know, maybe it's just because I've used belly bands for so long when I run, but I definitely prefer the belly band when I was running. Now one thing that the Liberty Band really shines at is when you're on a bike. If someone's out biking, this thing really, really shines. And this is the one example that the owner of Crossbreed gave me. She said, if I'm wearing a dress, I go for the Liberty Band. If I'm on a bike, I go for a Liberty Band. When she said that, I was like, yeah, because I've tried carrying a belly band on a bike and leaning over on the handlebars is terrible on the gun. It sucks. You can't really do three or four o'clock because everyone's going to see. So the belly band, on uh, the Liberty Band, being able to carry up a little bit higher when you're on the bike was great. We took a couple bike rides as a family and it was out of the way, it was great. As long as I don't wear too tight of a shirt, I definitely tend to wear a little bit of tight shirts. If I have a really tight shirt on, it prints pretty bad. As long as I have a normal fitting shirt on, or if you ladies have something flowy on, um, you'll be good to go, no problem there. The last thing I did is I talked to my wife about this. Being this is made, Ideally for the ladies, you know, the ladies in a dress or yoga pants or anything like that where you don't have a belt, it'll feel like wearing a belt, whatever, this is for her. So I tried, had her try it on and put the gun in there and see what she felt, how she felt, and the belly band, see what she felt. Did not like the belly band, that was too big for her. She's a short woman, she didn't love the belly band. She's like, it's not uncomfortable, she just, she didn't like it. So she did prefer the belly band. She wrote it right here. Uh, right under her breast and again when a woman has a flowy shirt on or a flowy dress or anything like that and obviously just the anatomy of their breast is going to hide the gun under much much better than a guy will but my wife uh, gave the stamp of approval to the Liberty Band she liked it she thought it was a good idea and a good way to carry again if you're biking or if you have a dress on again the yoga pants anything like that it is uh, a deal for stuff like that all right that's the testing that I did. I hope I did a good job being this is something not, again, ideally made for me. Pros, super simple. What a simple but effective idea. It's not simple, stupid simple. It's simple and effective. Like they built some, uh, it was purpose built. That's what I want to say. So it's high quality, it works well, it's simple and it's purpose built. Again, the, the, the yoga pants I'll say, anytime you don't have a belt on, I don't want to pigeonhole it to yoga pants. Um, anytime you don't have a belt on, a dress, uh, riding a bike, anything like that, absolutely ideal for any of those scenarios. Uh, cons, I don't really have anything. Again, it's 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 made for a purpose. I personally wouldn't carry it every single day. Um, a lady may feel different than I do, but hey, it's 35 bucks in that area. It's very, very inexpensive, so I thought it was good. Uh, I really want to stress um, if you're going to do something like this to practice, get out and practice, practice, practice. It's very, very different. Don't get me wrong. After 10 reps, 5, 10 reps, I was very comfortable and it didn't phase me at all. But in the beginning, it was really, really weird. And having to do that under stress and the need of actual self-defense would be scary. So uh, make sure you practice. Uh, all right, let me thank some people. I got. Uh, they, I want to thank Crossbreed. They did send me the Liberty Band and all these other holsters you see here. They're a very big supporter of the channel. Code Tiberius20 if you want to pick anything up from them save you a few bucks i started doing my giveaways again on my patreon channel if you want to support me on patreon this month's giveaway is this nice little med kit from live the creed has a um swat tourniquet and a stop the bleeding gloves and every month i will do a different giveaway on my patreon channel if you want to support me we have swag if you don't want to support me on patreon but you do want to support me we have the softest nicest t-shirts in the game we have patches link is down below if you don't want to do that either, that's okay. I forgive you. I love you. It's okay. No big deal. Don't don't cry about it. If you could, though, 
like, comment, subscribe, enable the bell notification. Those things are free. They still definitely help, and I appreciate it. I'll see you in the next video. Peace!